Hi there, Ken Bader here, the owner of BTC Small Business, which is a sub-brand of Bader Training and Consulting Incorporated, a business that I started about 12 years ago. Uh, basically, I run three different brands. Uh, the Bader Training and Consulting brand is, is the parent company. And what we do there is provide strategic planning, culture building, and brand concept to medium size to larger small businesses, let's say, um, that have, say, 50 employees or more, usually have revenues close to, if not above, a uh, million dollars per year. Uh, the BTC Small Business brand, which is why you may be joining me today, is concentrating on helping the smallest of the small businesses because those folks need a little bit of help uh, and sometimes they, they don't have the capacity not only from a resource standpoint but also just simply from a time standpoint to go through an extensive strategic planning, consulting uh, type of an engagement for weeks and weeks on end. So what BTC Small Business does is focuses on giving the smallest of the small businesses like your retail shops, coffee shops, restaurants, places of that nature, just that little bit of help. Uh, and that little bit of help usually comes with business development consulting, helping them to grow their business, merchant services where we can provide some cost effective credit card processing as well as the machinery as well as for certain retail businesses that make sense a loyalty program uh, which will help to if used properly in their marketing mix drive more business and repeat business to their business the third brand that i run is is the police officers credit union association uh, which is more tied to the beta training and consulting parent company where we help police credit unions throughout the country again make sure that they have the proper strategic planning, grow their culture, build their brand, and help police credit unions proliferate even more throughout the United States. Areas of specialization, I uh, already talked a little bit about that in terms of the strategic planning, brand concept, and culture building. But when it comes to BTC Small Business, that gives us, particularly me, a real opportunity to give those little pieces of advice that tie to strategy, branding, and culture to those little retail businesses, whether it be a salon, whether it be uh, a, a coffee shop, as I mentioned before, um, a, uh, a little storefront, um, furniture store, things of that nature, uh, because those folks need that little bit of help. Uh, but most importantly, the way that, and, and this ties into the specialization, uh, the way that I'm able to, to work with some of those small clients that won't pay a large consulting contract is through providing those merchant services because it allows us to earn money on the back end through residuals. And it's obviously in our best interest to give them that little bit of help so that they can make more sales and increase their credit card processing uh, rather than less sales. So that specialization of, of helping them to grow and giving them some of the tools and even some of the basic tools like the credit card processing and the loyalty programs is, is what we do to, to help to bring them just slowly to that next level. Unique products or services, you know, one of the loyalty programs or the specific loyalty program that we offer is Spot On, uh, which includes a small tablet uh, and unlimited cards. Uh, also has apps for the Android and the iPhone, um, which will help them to, again, draw more customers and bring in more repeat customers if used properly. Uh, obviously, from a marketing standpoint, which is one of my expertise, we can give them the help to to do that marketing properly and not just give them a tool um, another thing that we do is is we offer something called a p-tag uh, which I have another video about and I can certainly share with anybody that wants it uh, but basically what we treat the p-tag is is as a mini billboard something that will go on a, a bottle or a cup at Starbucks so forth that could have just a little bit of information in a QR code, uh, which is a, uh, an interesting little tool. Um, also, service standard creation. Uh, a lot of times, 
we we don't have the systems in place whether we're a small retail shop like a mechanic uh, or a large organization like say a bank with multiple branches the systems in place that tell our employees exactly what standards they should be adhering to and how to provide the service and brand the experience if you will uh, for their unique customers client makeup um, you know I've, I've worked with businesses as small as two employees to as large as 500 or so um, I would say generally the companies that I work with whether it's on the BTC small business side Bader Training and Consulting, or even the Police Officers Credit Union Association tend to have 10 to 100 employees. That's a, a, a good way of, of narrowing it down. Uh, what's in it for my power partner? Well, number one, I'm more than happy to pay referral fees. Um, I think that that's a very basic and rightful incentive. Uh, obviously the referral fees will vary depending on the level of business and we can certainly talk about that uh, but I'm happy to uh, to pay people uh, for introducing me to people that are going to lead to good business uh, reciprocal services I've done this before uh, which is kind of a quid pro quo um, maybe I can offer some consulting um, at a low or no cost for something that you have to offer. Um, I've even traded haircuts uh, for a little bit of advice before uh, and you can see that I don't necessarily have a, a, a complex style here but uh, uh, that's just one example. Uh, access to my network, um, you know, I won't boast that, that I know tons of people, but I have a pretty robust LinkedIn network, uh, pretty good network, not only in Southern California, uh, but also where I'm originally from in the Midwest and the Chicago area. So depending on what your business is, you know, I may be able to introduce you to folks uh, both in California and in other areas that would make sense and, and really need your particular services. Uh, and strategic partnership. Um, you know, obviously, as a small business myself, as I'm sure a number of you are, uh, to be able to align with people that will will do certain uh, or bring certain expertise that I don't bring uh, makes a lot of sense. A good example is I do a lot of consulting from a management and marketing standpoint, but one area that I don't hit upon to a great extent is human resources consulting. Uh, I'll talk a little bit about it from a service standard or cultural standpoint but when it comes to the actual nuts and bolts of the law and ethics and morality and so forth and and what the different nuances are in the the different states per se um, that's something that isn't an area of expertise for me. So I'm more than happy to, to partner with an expert in that particular arena and, and parcel that work out. Uh, other information, um, yeah, I've done a lot of articles um, which uh, I regularly uh, share with partners with potential clients it, it helps them to uh, get a little education and, and learn a little bit about my particular psyche. Um, also uh, wrote a workbook on strategic planning not only for financial institutions but a separate one uh, specifically for the business owner, entrepreneur, or manager uh, where it tries to go to a, a very base level and just give these folks a little bit of help because focus is a tough thing these days and I put it in a pocket guide form which is pretty easy to follow. I'm also currently working on a larger book which is titled The Formula for Business Success equals B plus C plus S and it just simply talks about the importance of the alignment of the brand, the image that we have externally, the culture, the image that we have internally with our employees and how we behave and the strategy of how we promote the brand, how we build the culture and how we get frankly more people to buy more of our stuff uh, and uh, while that sounds complex uh, I'm trying to keep it fairly uh, easy and tongue-in-cheek so uh, people will find it to be an, an enjoyable read rather than necessarily an academic read. 
what do I have an immediate need for? You know, right now, more retail businesses uh, would certainly make a lot of sense for me. Um, good targets are um, those folks that maybe have four or five employees that could not only benefit from the merchant services and loyalty program part of the business, but also look to get just a little bit of guidance, a little bit of guidance in marketing, a little bit of guidance in business development, a little bit of help maybe in, in culture building in that service standard creation that I talked about. Um, that would be of help. And then, of course, obviously, the, the larger clients out there um, I have a lot of experience in strategic planning facilitation and probably uh, one of the top three things uh, that I offer that I really, really enjoy and that I'm passionate about. So uh, those organizations that are looking for one or two or three day facilitation of strategic planning are certainly folks that I'd be interested in speaking to. Uh, with that, the best place to reach me is either on the company line, which is 714 Six eight one two eight two one, or you can reach me via email, which is kbader at btcinc.net. And of course, I always welcome uh, any LinkedIn requests um, that are out there because I find that to be uh, a very valuable business social media to tool. Excuse me. With that, uh, again, this is Ken Bader, uh, owner of BTC Small Business. Uh, appreciate you taking a little bit of time learning a little bit about me and uh, my organization and I'm looking forward to learning more about your organization and how we may be able to partner for both of our successes in the future. Have a great day.